For Albert Venison and the vast majority of older people, retirement means a significant reduction in earnings. I mean, basically, my income is, is two pensions as such. Um, my the private pension I, I started on my own, which I paid for all my life, of course, and also my state pension, which I paid for all my life. My my actual income is round about eight hundred and fifty pound a month, and I can guarantee that out of that eight hundred and fifty, I'm spending eight hundred and seventy five pound a month, not just on um, luxuries, but on essentials, things like food, heating, and we have the highest water rate in the country, as you know, down here. But having an ageing population also affects economics at a national level. There are more pensions to pay and less tax and national insurance for the government to collect. And that creates what's called a high dependency ratio. A country's dependency ratio tells us about the number of people who are of working age and those who are dependent on them. To work it out, you add the percentage of the population under 15 and over 64 and divide that by the percentage of people who are of working age. In the UK, 19% of the population are under 15 and 16% over 65, making a dependency ratio of just under 54%. In other words, for every 100 people who are working, there are 54 who are dependent on them.